Rose! No matter how hard I try to tame this chaos with procedures, someone always manages to fuck up my little corner of hell. How hard is it to keep a door locked? Let this serve as a lesson for you. Not to fall asleep on the job. Demons and other creatures of the night have found a refuge here in the San Francisco of 2179. are not too distant. So many mutants are being repopulated by the government to a district camp in San Francisco Bay. Yet mutants are still among us, bred to fight each other in illegal bullpens lining the pockets of bloodthirsty gamblers out for cheap thrills or fast money. Coming fighters can fight here. Okay. What? You said okay. And then the big pit will showcase the best fighters downstairs. Okay. What? He said okay. What's wrong with him? Why does he keep repeating himself? Don't trip, man. She got a lot going on. Okay. What? He said that this place is big enough to house 12 bull pits. Just what we need, baby. Smaller places, more intimate. Lots of blood splatter on their face when they're watching the bouts. Tenants. Oh, God. Rats? I hope there aren't any more surprises. No, don't worry. Nobody's touched the place since it's changed hands. Okay? Here, let me show you this room over here. So, hey, what you doing? Is it my place? Uh, he must have been hiding here the whole room. What? He must have been hiding. I ain't leaving. This place gives me the creeps. <laughs> but you've been watching too many horror hollows. You know, it cost me nothing. Dirt cheap to get this spot. As soon as I convince Orson to flip on his old boss and join my crew. Well, what makes you think he won't flip on you when he gets a better offer? Catch me, slowpoke. You keep on messing with me. 
I'm gonna throw one of these on your ass. Hey, where's that door lead? To the basement. Hey, uh, what's with all the blood, man? Oh, uh, this is where the former owner relinquished his claim on the property, so to speak. What? I wish you'd stop talking so much. He was saying that this is where the former owner gave up the property. That's what all the blood is. He was butchered. I need new ear pods. After that last ear tunes upgrade, this thing has been acting up. I don't mind the blood, man. Bitches. You know. Never satisfied, always looking for something to complain about. It's a woman's prerogative to change her mind. Yes, baby, but still. Hey, man, give me three feet, all right? You can't start a new business without spilling a little bit of blood. I mean, it's, it's the rules of the game. I've seen enough of this basement. Let's go. Okay. this place. Hey, man, make sure trouble doesn't find her. What the fuck? They ask you what you're doing to my crib. But I guess you don't need to tell me since you're going to have the heat. Hey, man, give me 50 feet. Sure it couldn't interest you in the whiff of my perfume? Yeah, you keep on talking, I might take a liking to you. Same thing. I used to be like you, young once, out to prove myself. If I didn't have a gun to do it, I had to use my head. Blood for blood. It's all it ever leads to. You'll tire of it someday. When you do, you wake up and you ask yourself, is it all worth it? Really make your head spin. Make you regret some of the things you did. Some of the things you didn't do when you had the chance. But you're a real badass, aren't you? What? You heard me. Hey, man, you really pushing me. <laughs> There's worse things than death, believe me. Oh, you a real piece of work, you know that? <laughs> How many bullets you got in that thing? Fifty? Hundred? See what kind of marksman you really are. Wouldn't be was for anybody, mind you. Okay, now this is going far enough now. Say what? You ain't got enough? Need to get yourself some more firepower? Hey man, I ain't playing with you. I will shoot you. And give my master another spin of the wheel. Ain't nothing more right than that. Fires, your heart's black enough. Been a long time since I ran into a nutcase like you. The way you're living life, you ain't got much more time on this earth. Why don't you just cut loose? Here, let me make it easier on you. Hey, was that you doing all that shooting? I was just cleaning up the place. Here, I'll take care of it. Don't worry. What? He said he'll take care of it. Oh, you are dirty. He said he gonna take care of it. He don't know the shit already been taken care of. I bet you ain't gonna have no more problems with no damn squatters. Hey, what squatters? I was just down there, I couldn't find any. I mean, you must have chased them all off. What? Oh, he said you chased them all off. There's nothing down there. What do you mean there's nothing down there? Wait, did you see something down there? Hell yeah, I just saw something down there. I just saw a motherfucker I shot up full of holes and left dying in a pool of blood. That's what's down there. Well, I mean, I was, I was just down there and there was nobody, nobody, nothing there. It's, there's no fresh blood anywhere. 
Are you fucking with me? No. Are you fucking no, with me? No, sir. Ouch. Come on, let's go downstairs. Come Wait, on. Can I turn this up? Can you hear it? No, I can't get your ass downstairs. You come on. Let's go. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Check this shit out, man. Yo, it was right here, man. I emptied my gun into the fucker. Uh, I know. There may be hidden passages throughout the building. He could have gotten away. This house has been around for thousands of years. Survived earthquakes, nuclear attacks, the mutant wars. Maybe it was a ghost. This place must be haunted. Nobody ever comes near here. Oh, bullshit. He just crawled off and died somewhere, that's all. Give me two feet, man. Come on, baby, let's go. Come on, baby. You had one in you. What's the matter with you? Are you trying to kill me? What's going on? It's that shitty prod of yours. He gave me a, gave me a spasm. Don't blame me. Stupid cheap import. When's next fight, huh? I get one from you. Uh, Adam's right? zappers, huh? Oh yeah. <laughs> See what you mean, baby? Now that I see him up close, you could make a lot of cash if you put him out to stud. Six for six, man. Lucky number seven's up next. You went upstairs in my main pit. I take you into my stable. Hey. This looks like one of those old-fashioned bomb shelters. Orson, where are the keys? I think one of these may work. Nobody locks a bomb shelter shut from the inside. Maybe it's where Orson's last boss kept all the bodies. Huh. Orson, you work on that. Get that door open while I go upstairs and watch this dog man's next fight. Come on, baby. I don't think I win another one tonight. I wouldn't want to see you lose your winnings. Let me rest overnight. 
Who told you you could talk to me, dog? some delay? Yeah. Your boss's hoe's been sniffing around my dog, man. No rush then, just sit tight. <laughs> she got you in a short leash too, huh? What are you talking about? Yeah. As long as we're waiting here, we get to know each other a little better, don't you think? We go far, you and me. We do extracts business really well. Uh -huh, um, yeah, I think they need me in the back room counting the receipts. Hey, you tell extract. It has more potential going legit with this. You're right. Then we shouldn't hold up the belt any longer. Besides, I got a door to keep it open. Come here. What's your hurry? Your boss's hoe is doing my dog man, all right? Look, hey. All we want to do is be friends, okay? <laughs> friends? Yeah. We done? Dugan? Steak? What's that? Red meat. Good for your blood rare. You like blood, don't you? I gotta fight now. There's more to life than fighting. Yeah, I got nothing else. My trainer's waiting. Are you being an ingrate? I don't know what that is. You know what I want. I have to fight now. Just remember, we have a date for supper tonight. I don't think so. Time for a look. 
could. I went to check on that dog man, Dugan. When he's cleaned up, I'm gonna get him some grub. Mm. So, uh, that's no bullshit you taking an interest in my dog man, huh? The whole place is buzzing about it. Mm, no bullshit. I had the kitchen make that food for him. You in the mutant dick, bitch. Mutant curb spotted, doggy style. You know I like it, Rob. Ah, oh, and that body of his, it... Come on, you know the score. Why else do you think we hooked up? I don't know. You tell me. It started when I was just out of pigtails and daddy's friends would fidget whenever I came around. Just kept going from there. Policemen, politicians, delivery drivers, sheiks. <laughs> Sometimes they come right out and ask for it. Sometimes not, but I learned pretty fast that all men are canines at heart. And you want to be that bitch? You don't get it. Don't get what? Dugan doesn't have anything to look forward to. I like the idea of bringing pleasure to somebody who's never had any. So you, uh, you want to give him a sympathy fuck, huh? Well, you go ahead and you do that. Mm -hmm. But when you do, don't come back around here. that all about? What? I heard you lied to that trainer. You haven't been talking to anyone else about a revolt against extract. Oh, you're thinking for yourself now, huh? Okay, well, here's what you get. He's dropping my conversations. <laughs> <sighs> We're trying our best with the cellar door. It's just taking more time than we expected. Yeah, OK. It's cool, uh, as long as you get it open. Listen, I'm going to ask you a question. What do you think about Dugan? As a fighter? No, as a fucking mascot, you stupid motherfucker. Of course, as a fighter. Uh, well, he's had an easy time so far. I'm not sure he's worth the money his trainer's asking for. Listen, I want you to do something. Set a match between Dugan and Iron Jaw. If you really want to see how much punishment Dugan can take, why not have him run a gauntlet? A gauntlet? <laughs> yeah, you line up all the fighters in two rows. Dugan has to battle his way from one end to the other. If he survives, yes, he'll be at a commission for a long time, but you'll know he has what it takes. If he doesn't, no laws. I'll set it up. No. You get that door open. My bitch might be crazy, but she got me wondering what's behind it. So you don't want the trainers asking for more money for the gauntlet? Good point. I think you might have a future, young man. Handle it. Don't forget about that door. Nah,
So there's been a change in the lineup. Dugan now has to fight his way through the pack. No. Too valuable property. Let's go. Well, somebody has to run the gauntlet. Either him or you. All of the fighters will be in one room. This is your chance to move on extra. Gives you a little look, and I just want to show off. I don't Come on. care about her. I'm tired of living like this. I get the dogs to do the battle. I can be top dog when it's over. I want to fight to the death. If you don't want extract to hear about your plan, let me fight. Bethesda. You're not helping. Yo, give us three feet. Let us work. Hey, get that thing open if you know it's good for you. Thank you, Beth. You've been lovely. All right, stop. That thing won't budge. Okay, look what I've got here. Now, this will neutralize your shock collar. It's untested, but it should work. Let me put this inside here. Now, when the boss comes down here and shocks you for not getting the door open, you should only feel a slight tickle. We'll pretend you're getting the real thing, OK? Hey, what's this writing on the door? Blood. 
Tell me how you feel about giving Dugan some in his gut. Uh, for some page. This inscription is a marker for what some ancient Chinese monks believed was a portal to hell. happened here? Oh. <coughs> Orson, what happened? Uh, I don't know, some kind of explosion. That's how the monster got in, a bomb? Where's that girl who's here with me? A monster? <laughs> what is she looking at? Oh, no, 
someone stop her. That's a doorway to hell. What are you talking about? <laughs> Millennia ago, this was a battleground between good and evil, and so much evil blood was spilled that it created an opening into hell. Legend says that some Chinese mystic sealed it, but now, for some reason, it's open again. How hurt did he hit his head on the wall? Hey, it's all true. Read it right here, from on the internet. I don't read, God damn it. But, he said there was a monster on the loose? Some kind of giant mutant dog is using dead bodies to clone itself. How hard did he hit his head in the last fight? So, Extract's hole walked into hell. Hey, that's her choice. She saved my life. Can we get her, bring her back? Legend says that as long as the demons do not gaze upon her, she can return to Earth. And what does the legend say about protecting your eyes from that searing light? Just close your eyes. Wait, what? What, are you nuts? You can't go in there. What good would you be? You can't see anything. Come Get a with bloody me. bloody stump for a hand. Come with me. Or are you too scared? Dugan? Back off. If you know what's good for you. Dugan. Dugan! Oh, go to hell. Waste your time with those other exits. They're all blocked. No one gets out of here until the boss says so. Oh. Uh. Fuck that. There's a monster in there. And he's killing everything that he sees. And he's turned Extract into a monster, too. So he's not going to be letting us out in here. Ah! Okay. I got you. Bethesda! Bethesda, can you hear me? Bethesda! Can you hear me? Bethesda, come back. It's not too late. Bethesda! Why don't you answer me? I'm looking for the owner of that big dog. He doesn't know he's missing. We're in hell. And unless you want to get stuck here forever, you better follow me back. Come on. Such a smart mouth. Ah, oh, Dugan. Look what I found. What is that? You got that in there? Yeah. Take that off. Why? I like it. Um, because you found it in hell. Who knows what trouble it'll bring? Oh, what? Take it off! What do you think it has like special powers? Ooh. <laughs> uh, uh -huh. It's just a dead bug. Yeah, you do a dead bug you found. <laughs> Stop! <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck you! <laughs> oh my god. Hey, calm down, kid. It's just Dugan. Orson. Oh, we've got to get out of here. Can't the dogman break the bars with its jaws? Forget about that. Where's this door go to? No one gets out till the boss says so. Yeah? 
Different door. Extracts, bitch. Uh, there's got to be some kind of a back door way out of here in case this place ever got raided. How much is your life worth to you? Uh, well, a lot. How do I know I can trust you? Uh, half now, half when we get outside. Yeah! I'm not going back that way. Suit yourself. No, what about my money? No refunds. Get out and see through the attic, but first we'd have to get past these hellhounds. Truly fucked here. Wait a minute, where does this doorway lead? Huh? Hey! Hey, this doorway, where does this doorway lead? That's where all the trouble started. It's a doorway to hell. Oh! Okay. Well, shit. Maybe we ought to get that thing closed up before something else gets loose. Where's the door? The door's right here. Ah. Oh. We tried, it's too heavy to lift. Oh, yeah? Well, you know, you know what we could do. We could use that door over there, but but wait, wait, that's the only thing between us and the monster dogs. So, you know, we could use this door over here, but no, no, there's an android on the other side waiting to flatten you if you so much as blow on it. Well, then how are we gonna close this thing up? Uh, we could summon whatever demon possessed her and play 20 questions. Here's the ring, tough guy. You wanna, you wanna try it on? You can call the demon. Fuck that. If we lure this android in here, Maybe we could distract him long enough for one of us to get out of here and come back with the cavalry. Okay, and that, that one would be you? You know, fire might work. Yeah, fire. The android's defense program kicks in, thinking his boss is still on the uh, inside. Fire in here big enough to attract an android's attention would choke us to death. Who said anything about starting a fire in here, upstairs, in the kitchen, where there's a ready source for you to burn? What, me? What, what about him? Oh, Dugan? He's running on fumes. He won't live through the hour. And him? Him. He's the backup in case you don't make it. Or I can just blow your brains out and tell the android that you're part of a plot to kill the boss and that more of your buddies are on the inside chasing after extract. As a matter of fact, 
That's exactly what I'm going wait, to wait, do. Wait, 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 wait. Just don't, don't, don't be so hasty. Now, it, it, if we burn the house down, it, it just might be enough to, to, to seal, seal off the hole to hell with, with all the rubble and stuff. And in, in all the confusion, all of us can get out of here. And on second thought, I, I think a fire won't be enough. It's going to have to be a major explosion. Ah, uh, no. I like blowing your brains out better. Wait. Okay, kid. So what do you need to bring this place to blow, huh? Building the pressure in the steam boiler should blow the roof off. The trick will be finding a bunker to shield us from the blast. But can't you knock out the androids first so we can get outside, be clear the explosion? Well, we could try and find the remote control and switch them off. It's the same fob that operates my shock collar. Thing is, it's in Extract's pocket, and I'm not about to go ask whatever demon possessed him to hand it over. What? The fuck is he saying? Are you having a seizure? No, no, no. You know what? He, he's trying to tell us something. What is it, boy? Is somebody trapped in a well? Is it a Um. It's me. Wake up. <laughs> what? I don't believe in loose ends.
you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking this thing right here is a problem because you can't go down this way. All the pressure will stop there. Vanquishing a demon won't be as easy as that. I thought we were pals. You will be his blood host. Blood host? Are you gonna cut me? Quiet, mortal. You have been spared from the carnage for a reason. My master, Zerundino, has chosen the darkest heart among us. And it is yours. Mine? What about him? He, he trained dogmen as pit fighters, don't you remember? He's probably done unspeakable things to them. This one's already been marked for menial duties and oh, Wait, wait, check, check again, check again. You, you barely got any blood from him. No, no, come on, come on. Don't be so hasty, come on.
You earned some peace. You want to die anyway. That's right. Pick out a nice, cozy place. Extract's too smart for you. Emergence of Zarundana. Climb down, use the fog. Save yourself.
still awaits. He hasn't killed as many as the others, but he is prime. The evil in his soul runs deep. <laughs> He's ready to show you his potential now, Master. Zerundanel commands you to follow. You are pathetic.
promised me unlimited power. <laughs> You born-again types. You're so easy to possess. You're always looking for shortcuts. You know nothing about penance. Let me tell you something. The illusion of power was all you were doing. I only needed a heart blacker than my own to pay my debt to Satan for failing to protect this door. Wait, so you're nothing but a doorman? <laughs> Making sure only duly authorized demons got in and out was a pain. Uh, if you can't handle watching the doorway to hell, then you sure as fuck can't cut it as an earthly demon. Not if a fucking dogman can take you <laughs> down. Tell me about it. I only hope I can return before anybody realizes I'm gone. I hate to think what the boss will do then. <laughs> Have to close the portal. Let's go. Stud thieves may be fucked, but Dugan's DNA may be worth something, huh? Oh! <laughs> 
you roast in the hole for an eon or two before I dispense of your punishment. There's no hurry. Down against Sharky. Any takers? Any in the back? Two? We can take over this place easily. Interested? You ever had a steak, Dugan? <laughs> <laughs> 